Greetings and welcome to an orchestra templates.com sample quickie. Organic Samples is a pretty new developer that has so far focused on small libraries with few patches that solve a specific niche problem. Today we look at their Majestic Horn, which is a French horn that purports to be majestic. Spoiler alert, it is. I bought Majestic Horn directly from the developer's website, which is a major financial outlay given that it only costs 2 euro. Yeah, 2 euro. There is no known direct or indirect affiliation with anyone involved with the product, and everything said in this video is my personal opinion not influenced by any third party. Majestic Horn is a direct download from Organic Samples website and it is delivered via browser download. We have the choice of downloading a version with only close and main mic positions, or a version with close, main, outriggers and surround. Installation is just a matter of extracting the downloaded file into a folder of your choosing and opening the patches in contact full. Download size is 8.2GB, after installation the installed library is around 10GB, so during download and installation about 19GB of free space are needed temporarily. The library needs contact full, 551 or higher. Majestic Horn is a solo French horn and comes in two patches. As noted before you can choose between a version with only close and main mic positions, or the full one with close, main, outrigger and surrounds. We look at the latter. The UI is fairly easy to grasp, with the four microphones displayed prominently in the center of the interface. Apart from your usual faders, you get a perch button for each position. Clicking on the abbreviation of the positions lets you send it to a specific contact output. Legato on-off, as well as speed by velocity, switches around off that center part. The longer button has no effect in Majestic Horn. Below this center area are a few more special settings that affect fake round robins, the included convolution reverb, release tails and how much the range of the instrument is to be extended beyond the recorded range. Let's start with the sustains patch. You get what sounds like three dynamic layers with the four mic positions. Here's a single sustained note with all four positions individually, then together. Playing chords works very well too, so you can use Majestic Horn as a makeshift small horn section. The release tail slider comes in quite handy to tame the response of the room if you so wish. Majestic Horn provides an optional second round robin by means of borrowing the neighboring note. There's a round robin reset key to make sure you always start on the same round robin. The legato button makes the patch monophonic and works well enough to glue the notes together if you want to play in a more melodic fashion. The legato patch has a single dynamic, with the module providing artificial volume dynamics. All four mic positions are at your disposal here too, but the real money shot here is the legato. You get very pronounced transitions that clearly separate all notes and are wonderful for melody lines.
Thanks to the long transitions, even faster lines can be pulled off quite convincingly, if you learn to deal with a delay in reaction. Speed by velocity is a nice feature that ties the speed of the transition to how hard you play. This works extremely well, especially in situations where the regular legato delay is too much. I have to admit I still prefer the regular legato though, as I feel that the longer reaction times are a good trade-off given how great the legato sounds. Both patches also have a built-in convolution reverb that does a decent enough job if you need some reverb, but do not have something of your own. Majestic Horn works great as a solo horn library, but also as a small horn section. The sustain patch has an impressive range of timbre and can cover most lines needed in the mockup. The legato works beautifully for a leading melody. It's definitely, per the name, more on the majestic side. Do not expect quadruple forte here. Majestic Horn will easily integrate in your existing template thanks to the four provided mic positions. With only two patches, setting it up as a breeze, and I prefer to just route it to my solo horn bus. Little treatment is necessary and I insert it directly on the input bus for VPro. Controlling the instrument via the mod wheel for the velocity layers is easy and no other controls are needed, but can be assigned if needed by right clicking on the item and assigning a fader or knob. You might want to load a second copy of each patch in, the sustain with scripted legato and the legato with true legato off, just to have more options while playing. There are plenty solo horns, and actually some really good ones. But at the price of 2 euro, Majestic Horn is basically a freebie and an awesome one at that. And also you can never have too many nice solo instruments. So whatever alternatives there might be, get Majestic Horn regardless. Majestic Horn is a very expressive solo horn with a great legato system that works amazingly well for melody lines as well as for basic section duty. Like other organic samples products, it really focuses on its one core strength. And it does it as well as anyone could hope for. I hope you liked this overview of Majestic Horn. Let me know your feedback in the comments. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you'll be notified of new videos. Take care and see you soon.